And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Well, this game is far from over. They'll probably get one more big chance before the end. The crowd certainly think so. Just listen to that noise. Marquinhos must tread with care. Kylian Mbappe. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And this situation could be dangerous. Determined defending. Idrissa Gay on to Neymar it's got to be Neymar majestic piece of goalkeeping well he loves the big moments doesn't he and he's proved it again there great goalkeeping well they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change fired over by Messi not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Lionel Messi. Neymar! Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Let's see about the delivery. The clearance wasn't decisive. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Five minutes left. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Can they keep it out? It's got to be. And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it. Well, here it is again. 2v1 against the keeper, and they make no mistake. It's a well-taken goal in the end. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. The referee might well have been tempted to book him for that, resisted the temptation. finish oh commanding goalkeeping who can he pick out and the opportunity was there yeah it's a well-worked corner and he makes decent contact just lacking that bit of accuracy
We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Effective challenge. And teammates around him. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. But fair play, that goes down as a very good recovery. Lionel Messi. And that will do it for this game anyway. And it goes into the history books as a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their performance? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Lionel Messi. Neymar! Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. If they can score again from this corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. It's got to be. And a goal! to put the final stamp on it that will do it can he finish oh commanding goalkeeping who can he pick out Substitution it is for PSG. Renato Sanchez. Plenty of support here. And let's give credit to the defending. He continues his run. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Well, just look at the defending here. They just don't read the danger. It's a poor goal to concede. Back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Perfect challenge. And he's broken free. Now well, he'll be irked with himself, ran into an offside position.
And just five minutes remaining. This might be ideal for the counter. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Now well, they've lost the ball. He's in here. And a goal! If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Let's take another look, and you have to say the defending is so poor, that's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. Well, they have it again. He's in with a chance. It has to be, surely. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and the movement is so good that they end up with a 2v1 against the goalkeeper who was completely exposed. Great play, but poor defending. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Opportunity here, and hit with ferocity, it was close, but not quite good enough. Sofian Diop. He's in behind. It's got to be. Still could be dangerous. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. And the goalkeeper got there. Well, that could have gone anywhere, but the keeper's reacted really well. Struggling to keep the ball. Mbappe. Pablo Sarabia. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front.
Willy Bolly. Unable to keep the ball that time. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Great opportunity. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, attacking possibilities. Can he finish? And the ball is loose. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. But the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, here's the replay. Yes, it's a decent shot, but the goalkeeper has to do a lot better there. He's parried it out into a dangerous area, and suddenly the ball's in the back of his net. It's poor goalkeeping, you have to say. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Just not looking confident in possession. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Well, that's the end of that move for now. He's in here. And the shot just over the top. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Oh, he's through here. Off the post and back in play. Fired in by Neymar. Well, it still could be dangerous. And Neymar. Lionel Messi. And a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, here it is again. And the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area. Just poor defending all round. Well, the ball is rolling once more. PSG dominant, and it's starting to get out of hand, you just feel. Very quick thinking there. Dennis Appiah. That's very effective, good high pressing. Well, he's lost the ball. Getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Still a chance. What a lovely strike. Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here it is again. And I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. And into the last 15 minutes of action. So on the cusp of the final Hang whistle... On Derek, what a chance this is! A goal! We're really being spoiled! This is attacking football at its finest! Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. And fine work from Paris Saint-Germain to win the ball back. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Well, disappointing end to the move.
Well, these fans are making for the exits now. Their team have been totally outplayed today. Marco Verratti. Oh, in with a chance. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Ten minutes to go. Well, PSG doing well to regain control of the ball. Verratti. And they'll be happy to have regained possession. And he has options available. He's in behind. There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here it is again, and what a good bit of skill from Neymar to go past his man. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Mbappe. It's with Korcha. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. He's lost it. Marquinhos. This is Sergio Ramos. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Gives it a go. Just made sure nothing came of that. Sissoko applying vigorous pressure and he's broken free giving it a try and there is the goal to make it a hat-trick excellence in finishing there for all to see Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Mbappe. And he might be through here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And PSG giving it away. Poise and purpose here from Verratti. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today.
And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Now Messi. Oh, he's through here. It's still alive. And it's there for him. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Klosterman. Oh, they have it again. Real chance. And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Well, here it is again, and they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non-existent. That should never happen. So on with the game. Much to admire about PSG, who look as though they're really in the mood. Plenty of support here. A really intense pressure applied. Whatever way you look at that, it's been squandered. minutes remaining Leipzig come away with it Benjamin Henrichs Nkunku and with that the attack fizzles out and there's been a change to the scoreline in the City game Alex Scott has the news and it's his second goal for Manchester City. They've pulled one back with 73 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Well, they get the ball once more. In with a chance. The net is staring him in the face. A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the good now. Well, just look at this again. It's good movement, the timing of the pass is perfect, and they leave the goalkeeper with no chance. That's an excellent goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Close to man. Determined defending. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. Well, some referees might have elected to hand out the yellow card, but no booking on this occasion. And well, they've been getting two substitutes warmed up, and both will come on here.
Gay. On to Neymar. And back with Gay. This looks promising. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Promising sequence. And still danger here. Nicely blocked. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Given away by PSG. Well, Leipzig have been very poor today, and the fans have had enough. They're leaving early here. Well, they've decided to make a change. Moving forward effectively. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And the counter looks on here, options available. Well, it fizzled out. And Kunku. Well, the supporters think it's on. And it's gone behind for the corner. And over it comes. Well, still an issue here. Nicely timed tackle. Sarabia. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Can he find the right pass? And he's made headway. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. there were any lingering doubts about the outcome surely they now have been removed well, that's he. well straight at the goalkeeper then not much time to make up his mind As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. What a shocking pass, really. Oh, breezing past him. Has a go. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. But it's an out and out pasting 6 0. And the referee's whistle, that is the end of the story.
Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And over comes the corner. A very effective clearance. Now veering in field. Simple catch, really. Rudiger. Well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. It's an obvious offside. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, the stats tell you everything. He's a top-class striker. Even when he's having a quiet game, he can still pop up with a goal, as we may well see today. Well, they get the ball once more. Neymar's there. Others might join in. In it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Time for a change then. Thirty minutes to go then. Needed to be more accurate than that from the keeper. And a throw in then. Neymar Jordi Alba making sure nothing came of it right let's bring you a goal update from the Angers game and that means we join Alex Scott yeah it's a goal for Monaco they're now behind by one with 63 minutes played thanks for the update Alex and with that the attack fizzles out Lovely work to get past his man. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point. And momentum is with them. Well, here's the replay. And I have to say, the keeper's got his angles all wrong there. That's a poor piece of goalkeeping. So, a level contest. 1-1 and they will be awarded a free kick for that clean challenge This could pose problems for the defenders. And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes! Incredible stuff! Well, let's see this again. What a pass this is from Messi. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Lionel Messi! And second time around, he scores! But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? And let's give credit to the defending. Twenty minutes to go. 
Ren unable to retain possession. He's in behind. And a goal! What a magnificent display! It's such a one-sided contest here. Well, here's the replay, and they get this just right, don't they? The timing of the pass is absolutely brilliant. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Might be a chance here. Well, to think he only had the keeper to beat. Couldn't take the opportunity. Doesn't want to lose his cool here. Well, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Oh, he's done it! But hang on, offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here, but the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. Well, they've decided to make a change. Trying to really get at the opposition here. A fine reading of the situation. Well, big news I'm hearing. A penalty has been awarded in one of the other games. Alex Scott with the details. Yeah, it was a penalty for Leo. He sent the keeper totally the wrong way with that one. It's now 1-0 with 77 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. Not all that convincing defensively. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Verratti in with a chance. Not out of the woods yet. Well, no damage done. Well, no stopping him. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Marquinhos. Neymar. Determined defending. No worries for the keeper. So almost at full time and the home side very much in command. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. So, making the substitution now. Oh, he's lost possession. Lovro Maia. In possession, Flavio Tai. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Jordi Alba. Jordi Alba. Very quick thinking there. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can he find the net? And the keeper had the measure of it. Delivering it.
ball's gone and teammates around him wilting under the pressure and now they try to go forward it's there for him and stopped there by Marquinhos not the pass he had in mind well, taking into account all the stoppages three minutes to be added on Neymar giving it a try another goal the lead grows to four now a rampant display well let's take another look and wow how cleanly does he hit that the keeper was never going to save it what a good goal that is. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. And there's the final whistle. And we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right. And their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Neymar's there.